Welcome to the Cubist demo. This movie will be based on the biological use case. To change the use case, use the option menu. We shall start by searching for the gene BMP4. The results include the gene itself and every annotation that features the gene. Clicking on additional data shows all the information in the repository. We can visualize a subset of the results as a graph. The green labels represent attributes and can be used to highlight nodes. Clicking on the green plus expands the graph by showing all the relationships. If you only want to see individual relationships, use the expand relations box. The repository can also be explored using facets. If we click on strength, we see all the levels of expression. We can further filter the data using the has value attribute. Returning home and selecting the gene facet displays a list of every gene in the repository. We can view a list of analytics related to genes. Let us select detected genes and tissues for Tyler stage 9. This provides a context containing all genes known to be expressed in stage 9 together with where these genes are expressed. Selecting a node displays the attributes and objects associated with a particular concept and updates the distribution graph. We can filter the lattice to reduce its size and complexity. Here we decide to show only those concepts associated with the tissue called embryo. By doing this, we can see that whenever a gene is expressed in the endoderm, it is also expressed in the primitive streak, a relationship we can follow up later. A range of alternative visualizations are available. Here we see a sunburst diagram. Notice that it is still connected to the distribution graph. We can move up and down the hierarchy by clicking on tissues. This enables us to focus on particular concepts and subconcepts. We can still use the filters to simplify the visualization. Now we have an icicle diagram. Large blocks have lots of objects and small blocks, few objects. We can focus on areas of the diagram by double clicking on a block. To move back, click on the top block. Thank you for watching this screencast of the Cubis prototype. We gratefully acknowledge support from the Edinburgh Mouse Atlas project and funding from the European Union. For more information on the Cubis project, please see our website.